Hi everyone, so let's get started. The first thing you're going to want your students to do is an interview with their mom or special lady. And in order to do that, I have for you uh, my interview sheets. And I give these out to my students in class and we review them before I send them home. And I typically like to send them home on a Monday and give the students a week to complete it. This way the families have the weekend to work on it, a little extra time. Um, but before I send it home, I do model how to conduct an interview with the students. Uh, it's something we always have a lot of fun with and it basically goes something like this. I call them over to the carpet and then I choose the student to come up and sit next to me. I tell the student that they will play the role of my mom and I will play the role of them. Um, and I'll model uh, for them how a question and answer interview goes with me taking notes as mom is speaking, um, but I usually like to make them laugh in some way as the interview is going on. So, as I said, I call someone over and it usually goes like this. Mom, what's your favorite food? And hands down, the children will always reply something like pizza or ice cream, and that's where you can kind of joke around with them and say, Mom, ice cream, but you always tell us to eat healthy. And the kids usually get a kick out of this um, when it goes on to say, Mom, what's something you're really good at? And the child replies, hopscotch or hula hoop or cartwheels. You go on to say something like, Mom, I've never seen you do that. So again, it's lots of giggles all around. The kids have a good time with it. Um, and after that, what I typically do is pair them up and have them do the same thing but with a partner and uh, everyone is giggles by the end of the class and ready to do some interviewing with their mom. Um, and in my packet I do have for you three pages of interviews. You can use one, you can use two, you can use three, just really depending upon the level of your students or really how much you want them to write. Also I've included an interview for a special lady as well and entitled in that way just because um, I've had had situations in the past where a child has lost a parent and we want to be really sensitive um, to those needs as well or perhaps um, it's you know a grandmother or an aunt who's very special in their lives maybe you want to make it a more general Mother's Day celebration in your classroom either way I just really wanted you to be prepared um, with an alternative so I hope you enjoy this and um, have fun doing interviewing skills in your classroom with your students. That's all for now. Bye.